from that. Ooh. Video guy. <laughs> if you're wondering why the videos are so good, yeah. Me. Good morning, guys. First day back for many, I hope, after Christmas. Hope we've all had a good holiday, all refreshed, raring to go. Cold one today, it's been quite mild actually in between Christmas. But anyway, I want to talk to you about. Um, getting our subscribers up to um, 500 I think we're currently about 350, 360 something like that so what I'm thinking is I'm gonna give one lucky subscriber 250 pounds when we reach 500 subscribers so all you have to do is first of all make sure you're a subscriber because only subscribers can win this money just for showing your loyalty to our videos so if you haven't already get on our channel and subscribe press the subscribe button and get any updates that's your first thing subscribe and then all I want you to do is type in the comments on YouTube it has to be on YouTube not on Facebook or Instagram whatever else on YouTube and just put the words I'm in that is it I'm in and then what we'll do is once we hit 500 subscribers I'll randomly pick a winner and I will let you know in due course who's won it. So what have you got to lose? So if you know anybody that wants to win 250 quid even, tell them to subscribe, comment, I'm in, the money could be yours. It's an easy 250 quid, isn't it? Justin at Airedale Fencing. Today we're at Buttershaw Cricket Club where we're doing a 220 meters of V-mesh two meter high fencing. So as you can see here, we started from this far corner this was yesterday so we're going to be starting around there we'll probably start in the corner we're going to be taking it all the way as you can see lads are already busy away cutting it down so part of getting the job we did say usually we'd sort the gates out but part of the getting job we're just going to keep the gates and we're going to level this post room as you can see it's uh, you know quite off centre um, let's go inside and have a look Obviously when we do get the job as well, we always ask the customer if they need any fencing removing. As you can tell, there's already a chain fence up. So what we'll do over the next like day or so is we'll start taking this down. Um, we may, because there's quite a lot of it, we may cut a bit down, do the fence, cut a bit more down, do the fence. Make sure it's all level, all the way down to the end and all the way up to that corner. We've already come all the way along here. As you see, we'll be coming to this post. Usually we do replace the gates and uh, make them to how you want them. Um, he actually wanted to keep the gates because they're not too bad. So like you see, we'll be filling this in at the end with an off cut. Hi YouTube, it's Mark from Airedale Fencing. Hope you guys are liking our content that we're putting out. Got loads more coming out this year. So if you'd like to subscribe, make sure you're doing that there actually giving away a big giveaway as well only for subscribers you've got to be in it to win it if we take a walk down we'll be able to see exactly what's going on so they're struggling at the minute because of these big trees here there's roots going all the way under the ground so it's making it twice as hard for them to dig an all. On two meters then, because this is two uh, two meter V V mesh. How how low down do you dig? Seven fifty standard. Seven fifty standard. If you hit something like a if you hit a service a pipe or something like that. Yeah. You've got to clip it. You got to clip it, right? Yeah. Yeah. And obviously that's for the two meter. That, that yeah. A bit bigger or a yeah. Point four. It's just because that weight alone, isn't it? Yeah, that is nice. That though, I'm not gonna lie. As you can see they've already lined it up, we didn't line it up. And uh, just attaching the clips up here, because there's no hole, we'll put a self tapper in. So basically we'll put it through and that, because as you can see that, that bell then clip. And then you just go to the other side, we already dug the hole, and then attach the other one. You want to see him attach this one? 
Well, so much on here, do you remember? So, adding water, <laughs> add cement mix, post mix. Obviously, he's already made sure it's all level and straight. Average two bags and all, one and a half. Depends how tight you dig it. Don't know if you can hear that. He said average is one and a half, two bags a post. Morning guys, day three at St Paul's Cricket Club in Buttershaw. Uh, just give you a quick update where we are. I seem to reach the corner yesterday. Got lads bringing out stuff over now. But yeah. And uh, rest to do, we've got right back of there and then all the way up there. I reckon what, Monday, Tuesday next week it'll all be complete and finished. But yeah, it's not looking bad. Got Jamie carrying stuff for once. Morning guys, so day four on the job and uh, we've got a fair bit done. We're actually gonna be finishing a day early. So I'll show you what we So I'm on the outside today. We're just picking up all these now. We'll take them to the scrapyard. But looks million times better than the old fence does. This post here is, uh, as you can, you can probably see it from this side, slanted and bent, so we'll get that straightened up probably Monday. Um, looking good there. Looking good. We've just got that top edge now to do from back there all the way to the end. And then jobs are good and um, so just to let you all know, um, I know a lot of people don't know, but it's a new transition for us as well. But the actual mesh fencing that you see behind, we actually supply this now in a wholesale to other contractors. So uh, we use the best quality of stuff, we use five five milli V mesh, uh, usually in green, green is the most popular and it goes from 1.8 meters to uh, this is two meter high and then to two four. And this is what we've done so far. When I say we, the lads are hard at work doing it. As you can see, it looks, looks very nice. Obviously we always at the end of a job as well, if you can actually see here, see how it looks, looks a mess. At the end of a job, we go around every single post, we clean it, we tidy it, and we make sure that there's no cement hanging about on the actual fence itself. Just a reminder as well, guys, that we do also put all our videos up on YouTube, hit us up on Facebook, have a look at our reviews on Google. Uh, we do live by our reputation, so we do have very good reviews. So don't forget to hit like and subscribe at the end of the video if you're happy with what you've seen.
Oh, this stupid clip, man. It's not stupid, it's you. <laughs> what are you actually doing? I'm trying to pull the clip out of here. It's a fucking clip, Justin. It's not rocket science. It is. Fucking island. Look. <laughs> you do it like that. Yeah. The clip. <laughs> 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 you want a bit on air? Well, we'll see. <laughs> well, yeah, guys, make sure you hit the like and subscribe. Check us out on Google, YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, all of it. Have a look at our comments and reviews. And uh, stay good. We'll see you soon.